Hello guys, this is Sam. Welcome to my channel. I'm playing Starfield. So in the last video, we went to meet the king or whatever. I think his name was uh, Delgado or Belgado, whatever his name was something. We met this Castillo guy also. Pain blade it's 90 damage. I'm taking two or three guns. I am taking this sniper. I'm definitely taking this sniper. Oh, it's 15,000. Still buying this sniper. And also, I'm buying this one. This one too. Um, I'm making buying this Equinox too because I'm gonna. We can talk about selling. I'm selling weapons too. Like this combat knife, this grinder. I just bought a modified equinox, so I don't make this one. Yes. 
Hacienda. I bought this one just a second ago. I bought this two also. I'm not selling this guns. I can sell this one, but it's a legendary one. But I have another. I was raised fleet. My mama joined up when I was 12. She was a first class smuggler. Wow. We'd always lived comfortably, but she took the offer to join when a job almost went south. She figured if anything ever happened to her, it guaranteed I'd still have a home. It's been non-stop. Even as a kid, I was helping distract security in those smuggling days. It's amazing how just having a child aboard, especially one as cute as I was, could throw off the scent. Between my mama and the fleet, I could talk my way out of anything and use or fix any weapon and ship in the galaxy. Real life skills, if you know what I mean. She can be my crewmate, right? She looks... I sell a little bit of everything, but only if it's hard to find, and only for a high price. Neuro amps, a few unique resources, maybe a specialized weapon or two, anything that's rare and in high demand. Don't miss me too much. First time visiting the infirmary, huh? Let me give you a piece of advice. Try not to get into too many bar fights. I'm trying to save my dwindling supplies for sale and pirates coming in off of raids. <laughs> That's what they all say, until they stumble in bleeding out on my floor. So here's what's what. You need med packs, curatives, preventatives, I've got you covered. At least as long as my current supply holds out. You need enhancers, legal or illegal? I got those two. In the fleet, someone has to do it, so it may as well be me. This <laughs> way, I've got a good idea of who's on what and how much. If they come in for any real medical treatment, I know exactly what I'm dealing with. A dealer with a full medical background. Thank you very much. Now, if you don't need anything else, I've got a particularly annoying supply issue to deal with. I suppose I can spare a few supplies. Boosted injector. I think I will take this one. Burns and frostbite. Treats dislocated limb, fractured limb, fractured spine, strain. Let's take this one. Soul addictions. Take 
one. What about five for nine eight? I don't want to take. You think most of the injuries I treat are from run-ins with security or civilians taking a stand? But I'd say at least half are just life from the key. Brawls, egos, and plain old stupidity. At least it keeps me busy. Now there's an offer I didn't expect. If you really want to help, I'm looking for someone who can handle themselves in a public setting. As in someone who knows how to get the job done without shooting up the place. That's not going to help. That ship was full of things like cots, flu shots, and children's vitamins. And I can't exactly plug a bullet wound with an ash chewer. I love it when people justify murder as being efficient. I politely requested a list of supplies from Gennady Eton at the clinic and was told the price of business has gone up. I think he's back on Aurora and he's upcharging me to pay for it. And if there's one thing I'm not going to do, he subsidizes his habit. I want you to make sure he delivers my supplies for the price we agreed on, but without raising any alarm. Oh, we will. But this way, I'll guarantee the highest quality supplies from one of the best medical facilities in the settled systems. Plus, if Gennady does what he's supposed to do, he'll cover our tracks. You can threaten him all you want, but if you start a fight in the clinic, the fleet's not rolling in to back you up. Oh, yeah. The funny thing is, he's the poster boy for upstanding moral citizens. Top of the class at nursing school, did volunteer work in backwater settlements, a reputation you could eat your food off of. Nobody knows he did it all zoned out of his mind. Nobody except his old boss, me. <laughs> he said he got clean when he joined the clinic. Now I wonder. A bullshit one, yeah? Gennady claims prices have gone up for the clinic as a whole, and that I'm not the only dog being hit. He says if I want cheaper goods, I'm going to have to find another supplier. He even gave me a list. But I'm not turning to some third-rate dog selling meds out of their space truck. Gennady and I had a deal, and I want him to honor it. Well, let's see what we're dealing with. Minor damage. Just so you know, I'm still shy. Let's get everything back into place. Done. A little more caution next time. Be careful. I don't have any supplies. cargo capacity for this amount of contraband. Oh, see in the left hand side, your cargo space, my cargo space is lower. Uh, only I can do this one, I think. The rate target is a cargo of ultra batteries stored at Hope Town on Polvo in the Bellow system. Okay, I think I can do this because this uh, this mission does on, doesn't require my cargo space. This two requires my cargo space that I have only 103. I need 450 to do both of these missions. Let's do this one then. I have to do one mission, right? I have to gain their trust somehow. Good luck with the mission. 
I'm constantly scanning for valuable shipments. You'll be given a target ship transport in the system to track them down. Just be sure you have the cargo space to get the goods. We have contacts throughout the settled systems that require shipments of illegal goods. Smuggling requires a bit of subterfuge since we'll be loading up your ship with contraband. If you want to make that delivery without getting caught, you'll need shielded cargo space to accommodate the goods. You don't know? Well, you're about to enter a whole new world. Shielded cargo space is a fleet specialty. It's made to fool the UC and Freestar Ranger scanners that are used to detect contraband. Speak to Jazz about that. She'll be more than happy to set you up. Good, because I do hate repeating myself. Very. You'll get a location with the target goods. We don't care how you get it, as long as you deliver. You get caught, that's on you. If you need credits, you will find me. If you got any spare creds, you just need to unload some junk, head to the depot. Robin, ask Jazz about any ship upgrades. Nothing worse than a packed ship with no personality. As long as you put the fleet first, we won't have any problems. Every time I see Ramsey smile, I want to punch him in the face. <laughs> that last shot didn't pan out. I need something bigger. A slow ship will get me caught. Talk to Jazz if he upgrades. Is this Jazz? I think it's. If you want to stay under the radar, I've got just the thing. So, looks like we got ourselves a new rook. Once again, I'm Jazz, resident engineer here. Like Neva said, you need ship parts, repairs? I'll hook you up, as long as your credits are good. Well, it did when I first got here. Most of these folks aren't too keen on maintenance. Today, the key's about as safe as any other UC station, just with a hell of a lot more personality. I can guarantee your ship will be in good hands, so if you're looking for an upgrade, let me know. We got the best selection in the settled systems. Illegal, unregistered, recalled, we sell it all, no questions asked. No, 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 no. You buy from me, you're worry-free. I can't have my customers getting caught now, can I? That's bad for business. Anything that keeps the UC and Free Star Rangers off your tail is a must-have in my book. Just let me know when you want to talk business. <laughs> Truth is, the fleet rescued me. Of course, I wouldn't have needed rescuing if they hadn't blown up the ship I was working on. Delgado plucked me out of space and brought me to the key. I took one look at the place and was compelled to work. Soon after, he offered me a permanent spot with the fleet. Neva's mine, so don't be getting any ideas. She may be a little rough around the edges, but she's just looking out for her own. There's no one better to have. Sure. It's not like I'm busy keeping this rust bucket of a station from falling apart. Sounds like fun. Let's see what I've got. I have uh, 22,000 credit. Need to upgrade ship. Shield generator, laser, cannon.
cargo space is not showing up here. Missile launcher is good. Care to upgrade that ship of yours? I don't mind helping, but... Shop's always open as long as you're... services. If you've got the credits, I've got the time. Sure, sure. Let me punch that. to the right tells you where new modules will appear when the floor was is at zero for example new modules will be placed in the center mass of the ship building new ship modules with cost credits and building them will give you credits back the ship builder will keep a running total and process the entire transaction with them okay It's anywhere else. 
not on that position only so you can uh, modify your ship here make changes Be able to piece it back together? What the fuck? I bet you would. <laughs> I'm just. She did not even tell me about the cargo. She lit cargo. Wasting any more time here, let's just go. I have too many missions to worry about. It might not be Jemison, but this ship is starting to feel like home. The paint protects are all, but you turn against us and you're dead. Shielding. I got secret compartments on my ship just in case. Nothing like the smell of a dead shark after you cook him with an energy blast.
need helmet man I told you you were wasting your time, Dal. I hate surprises. Just do what I say, and you might even walk away from this without turning into a goddamn ice sculpture. And Mathis, I am running things around here, so keep your mouth shut. You got that? <laughs> Fine. All right, listen up, because I am only going to go through this once. We are here to dig up any info about Griggs' legacy. We are not here to scrap for loot. Whatever you pick up, don't think, don't get creative, bring it straight to me. <laughs> so simple, even a rook like you can't screw it up. Hold on, no scrapping. How the hell am I supposed to make money around here? All right, that's enough. If either of you want to fly with the Crimson Fleet, then you need to follow one simple rule. When you're on a job, you do exactly what I say. No questions asked. If that doesn't work for you, just say so, and I will leave you on this ice bar without a ship. You will be dead within hours. Yeah, yeah. And there's one more thing. Your little friend can tag along until we get to the outer doors of the prison. But I will be damned if I'm letting them inside. Uh, very nice. I'll just remain here and soak in the planet's lovely winter-like atmosphere until I go hypothermic. We have a lot of ground to cover between the landing area and the lock, so let's get moving.
change my gun to this. Come on. Taking hell damage expense O2 Freezing golden snow as it is weather seek shelter immediately. I'm trying to get to into shelter. Jasper Gritz made the groundwork for finding the legacy and eventually the Crimson Fleet. The lock. Around five years. Rumor says he started planning his escape the moment that he arrived. Oh, grow a spine, will ya? There is a huge difference between being a coward and being careful. So both of you, watch yourselves. All right, let's keep moving. Standing out here isn't doing us any good. Yeah, you took your time unlocking. This ID card cost a small fortune. Let's hope it pays off. Before he can sell his I went in. <laughs> Digipic Milton in the upper 
see, man. I bet these things are crawling all over the place. Yeah, and their bodies probably heard us firing from about a kilometer away. Hallelujah. Hey, how about that? Guess you're not so stupid after all. <laughs> well, look at that. One firefight and the two of you become best buddies. Now let's see. Looks like we are inside some sort of prisoner transfer area. But everything is locked down tight. Since you are such good friends, why don't you and Mathis head up to that control room and see if you can get some more of these doors open? Okay. Let's go, buddy. We are on control room duty. Can't talk right now. The whole roof's coming down! I have only one digit. Well, this is just great. What are we supposed to do now? The plan? Who gives a shit about the plan? Let's face it, we're on our own now. Well, yeah, we'll get to that eventually. For right now, I have a much better idea. We use this opportunity to take out Delgado, and at the same time, make some serious credits for ourselves.
Whoa, whoa, hang on. G g give me a second to explain. Let's pretend for a second Delgado's correct. And there's information here about Crix's legacy. Once we get rid of him, we'll dig up the garbage ourselves and sell whatever we find to Neva. We'll be rolling in credits. No, 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 no way. Listen to me. We're going to be handing Neva leadership of the Crimson Fleet on a platter. She'll be thanking us for getting rid of Delgado. I mean, come on. I'll bet you a month's share that he's never been this vulnerable. It's perfect. Oh, fine. Suit yourself. You know, for a second there, I was almost starting to respect you. Now, let's find a way out of here. Lock intra prison message system. There are five blocks standard prisoner, standard prisoner, violent offender, high risk prisoners, country confinement. Jasper Kicks personal level. We have a class five extremely dangerous, highly violent prisoners transfer occurring today. Perform standard meetings and the prison meetings to look at it. Maybe that guy is still here. Attention! Lockdown mode has been rescinded. Yeah. 
conveyance and I'm walking through this scrap heap. Celsius. Cannibalized. Extra blankets. Brand Richard. Uh, I don't know any answers for these questions. No. changed your mind yet? Yeah, right. You saw it back there. Those things, whatever they were, they probably ripped into shreds by now. Did the job for us. And if they haven't, we can still handle the job. We just have to get our hands a little dirty. Wouldn't be the first time, am I right? Of 
of all the people to get trapped here with, why the hell did I get stuck with you, huh? Fine, have it your way. So, now that we've made it to the guard tower, what's our next move, genius? Been in a few slams yourself, I see. Okay, I'll follow your lead. He was following me from the start. Check from the on duty person. Call all security. I think. Oh, I think we found something, right? Okay, almost time. Cell D zero three one one eight. Okay, it's a place to start, I guess. Maybe we'll start from here in the next one. I think this is going to be a big one. So thank you guys for watching. Stay tuned for more and don't forget to subscribe. We'll start from in this place. So stay tuned and have a good day, guys. Take care.